Well, hello guys, this is me, Krish, again, and of course, here we go in our 2116 free-for-all match gameplay, guys. So anyways, if you guys, of course, are news, most likely needed to channels, or had your accounts go off, please subscribe to me, and of course, also subscribe to my girlfriend, her niece, well, I seriously need help with her voice a lot. I know I usually speak this very fast, and all. It's usually just to get the rally rolling of the match started and all. And it's really appreciated, too, that you also subscribe as well. That's why I do this. Don't do it just for the subscribers and winning and all that stuff. No, but all I'm just trying to do is have fun with you guys out there. And make some good contact. From what I said in all the other previous videos, cause yeah. Sometimes it's good to be heard, you know. Sometimes I just like to do it for the hear my own voice. I don't know. It's just really pops up in my head sometimes, you know. Some reminders just have to happen. I tend to sometimes forget quite easily as well. Especially with a lot that's been going on. Been feeling a little bit stressed though, just worrying a little bit too much about the future. But I just I just realized that I need to put some of the thoughts I just need to hold back a little bit, you know? Because it's not yeah, just because I'm 18 and now I'm basically a young adult. Doesn't mean I tend to have to worry about all the little things like the problems that I guess most adults tend to struggle with. I'm going to move on past this main goal. Man, this is coming out to be quite a good easy round so far. Oh yeah, and then the main fun purpose, yeah. Well, one thing's for sure, the scarrows is one good thing, especially if you can push other scarrows all stay right in the toxic. I don't even know why he hasn't taken any damage from the toxic. Wow. Okay, there we go, tripping a little bit there. Ha, huh, how do you like that? And then the one. Yeah, boy. Now I can tell that, he was very angry from that. Right, well, if you want to make any good machine mechanics work, right? If you want to make any point of use of your abilities, right, guys? One thing for sure, yeah, I mean, some robots even have a bigger advantage than I do. But the only thing that keeps happening is the mistakes, right, that some people sometimes make. Like, for example, going in the ball mode, when I had my ability act, like, all my weapons activated, I had the chance that I can destroy them, and sometimes I make that mistake too. Don't worry, guys. For any Scarlet players up there, you're not the only ones that made that mistake. That's right. When free throw, normally a, a sniper weapon can work out very well, but his mechanic defense systems work quite as powerful enough in so many cases. And I'm somewhat a strong player in this game. That's been constantly played for like four and a half possible years now, and. Got some set of skills right here, you know. And you kind of need that in part of the gameplay, guys. And so, right, I don't potentially need to just go for the only the third and second place guy. But I guess they just most likely have too much of an easy bot. They don't have too much tanks or anything. See, now I'm going to go after this guy since he came over this ball mode so soon. And what a bad mistake that all came out to be. This is why it's good to have lots of tanks. It's very, very good that you must get your Scarrow Spot at all costs very much upgraded and have an advanced repair unit with just the backup skill, too. Oh, this is kind of taking forever. He's not cooking really. You know, cooking too much of the damage, and so I finally managed to put some pressure on that guy. Even though he wasn't gonna move any time, basically, soon. 
Let me turn the stuff right there. Waste of a buy, I tell you. Awesome. Since it's only three. Three mini kills. Wowzers. Constant living legend moment. Ugh. Oh no. Don't suffer any more of this. A decent 11 kills will take. But oh no. Devastating. Right? But yeah, so free for all guys, if you want to be able, remember this tip, right guys? Whenever, like, if you want to be able to get any basic skills done, like, if you want to be able to collect as many KLs as possible, there are basic steps, of course, upgrading your robots and weapons to be at least level 9 or so, or level 8, because that's when you'll have a lot of better visual chances to go up. Rally you to break up Sandbox at some point. We got uh, three basic keys. We got a uh, skill. Skill is the most important efficient one. Another thing is timing it just right. That's another thing. Maybe I patient moment. Oh, and I just hate it when they when they have like the last percent of health. Yeah. You see, the mistake I just made there is was not timing it just right. Sometimes they'll have a feint of advanced healing as well, which can kind of trick you a little bit. So knowing your surroundings, there's another, yeah, so knowing your surroundings, knowing how quick they'll fire, which is that whole precision of timing it right there. And if you do have skills, make sure you know how to really effectively use your skills and effectively, maybe at a possible timing, just maybe. Yeah, like there's some sort of reasons why we use our uh, special abilities and then the counterized mothership abilities too. But every one of them come out to be a useful set of our entire bit of the game. Somewhat messed up. But we can still get the sleep to a problem. When nobody else is attacking the leech, that's my time to shine because only the Titans for some reason have. Well, your robots do have an advantage too, but mostly it's Titans because the defense migration and more persistence pretty darn well off the most robots. Not the. Sir Thought Hawk or Carpio Sirem. Those thoughts might not be harder to take down, really. But dear, yeah, we all know how well the leech thoughts can be quite a squishy robot just to take down. Not efficiently goes very well. But I guess you'd be surprised how well any robot can be still skillfully and yet too powerful actually. And you know why? All the so-called Tag is shield, the formal shield, all that stuff messed up really I'm talking about there. And so far I gotta get I'm gonna give the credit to the Kepri, the previous Kepri, that did the most damage to my Titan so far, right? Well good, I'm finishing off a Fanyar. So then in what the killer thing's going there. So this is it. Been building up kill streaks too many times now. Two living legend streaks and then building up uh, another kill streak after that. Slowly over time, yeah. And yeah, guys, I really hope you guys are enjoying so far. Making the most of timing worth it. Oh, <laughs> Oh dear no. Had to finish the, the player off. Nope, nope, nope. Had to be messed up. 
running out of his assistance while escaping from the guy. I just know how fast I can go, but... Oh. Couldn't reload my ability back any... Well... No, it was too... Yeah, I don't know. Great, it's over. Anyways, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. 3.1 million, almost 5,000 on a points here. Now, anyways, yeah, Christian signing off. Bye bye. Jamaican 420, also. Yeah, and as you can see, right? Four kills. Just taking a guess how much the second place guy did. Yeah, he guessed it. Three much four, followed by EI doing three and third, and three and fourth place for Osmo 1704. You know how pretty close they all came. Because I kept mostly stealing a lot of the kills, which is another thing that requires, like, if you know skills very well, skills is going to be your, always your number one thing, and timing it perfectly. Well, I wouldn't say perfectly, but mostly timing it is just about the right things. Uh, 